An MOS of Parliamentary Affairs, Vijay Goel, has landed in another controversy, this time for allegedly insisting on a personal coach to travel from the boarding gate to the aircraft at the airport in New Delhi. Goel, who was travelling to Jaipur on an Indigo flight, allegedly refused to share a coach with other passengers. Sources tell Times Network that the minister waited at the boarding gate for about 14 minutes till the staff arranged a separate bus. Hina has more details on what really happened. That continues to exist in the country despite Prime Minister Narendra Modi asking everybody to live like normal human beings, ordinary uh, citizens of the country. But once again, it feels that these mantris, they think they are above the common people and they demand special treatment. As far as the rules are concerned, so there is no such rule for any minister of state like this. Only civil aviation minister can be given uh, a special coach to be taken from the boarding gate uh, to the aircraft, which in the current scenario, in fact, Mr. Ashok Gajpati Raju also doesn't prefer. He travels like normal passengers like you and me. But here we had MOS for Parliamentary Affairs, Mr. Vijay Goel, demanding a special coach for himself. In New Delhi with video journalist Imran Hina Gambhir for Mirror Now. Well, that's what we are picking up right now. Uh, though uh, reportedly Vijay Goel has denied asking for any special VVIP treatment or a separate bus. But like Hina was pointing out uh, that uh, she has picked up from her sources that indeed he refused to go in the bus in which the other travelers, uh, other uh, airline passengers were and he wanted to go in a separate bus. I've got uh, Mr. Ejaz Ilmi on the phone line with me. Thank you so much for speaking to us. Is, is this kind of behavior justified? That a Neta wants a separate bus, he doesn't feel comfortable traveling in the same bus from the boarding gate to the aircraft. Well, I think most ministers fly most of the time and everybody boards the buses normally, uh, as the situation may be. But in this case, uh, Mr. Vijay Goel, uh, the, uh, the uh, Honorable Minister has denied that asking for a special coach, any special treatment. So I, I don't, uh, I mean, I, I think there's no, uh, there's no, I mean, it's just, it's, whatever your sources may be telling you, if the minister himself is denying that something like this happened, then I, I would rather agree, tend to agree that the minister must be knowing exactly what he's saying. Yes, but uh, because what we have been given to understand, Mr. Ajaz Elmi, that uh, uh, he, he was also a little upset about the fact that they had to wait for a few more passengers to come in and he was made to stand like that. Uh, and after which he said, I will wait until everybody else boards and then I will come separately. Uh, ha, ha, has there been a conversation by the party members? Have they checked with Mr. Vijay Goel what really transpired? Why is it otherwise that this is being reported? No, we, we've seen the statements in the media and we've also, uh, even your channel is also telling us that uh, the, uh, the minister has denied that such an incident took place. So, I mean, uh, obviously there, 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 there can be, there's no talk of this because the minister himself is denying that anything like this happened in the first place. All right. Thank you so much, Azaz Ilmi, for joining us. Uh, going across to Mr. Mohammed Khan as well. Right now, we are given to understand that Vijay Goel uh, claims that he didn't ask for a separate bus or a private coach. But our reporters uh, are, have learned that that indeed was the case, that there was a bit of a communication problem there, uh, and that the minister said he doesn't want to wait and then travel in the same bus. Your reaction, Mohammed Khan? Yes. Um... I want to say this. If you have the opportunity to read today's business standard, there was an offense piece by a lady called Mitali Saran, in which she perfectly summarized this government's attitude. And that is talent deficit, but ego surplus. This incident that has taken place is a clear and remarkable indictment of the kind of mentality that the BJP leaders possess. I must also take this opportunity to contrast this with my own leader, Rahul Ji, who yesterday, whose Twitter pictures went viral of him traveling with everybody after taking a regular commercial flight. In fact, somebody also mentioned there that our Prime Minister has been taking chartered flights since 2001 and has not taken a commercial aircraft since. So there's also a question of examples set by the leadership. Why should those who follow the Prime Minister expect any difference in treatment, any difference in treatment if their leader provides this example? So therefore, I think it is shameful that this government, which forswore that they would not uh, succumb to such symbols of power, would not be arrogant, have gone in the exact opposite direction and are shaming the country 
misutilizing its resources and is setting a bad example by and large. All right, Mohammed Khan, thank you so much for speaking to us. Uh, it's not about one party to the other. This mindset is prevalent across party lines, cutting across party lines uh, for all, so, so many of these netas uh, who believe that they are entitled because they are a member of the parliament, because they are a minister or a member of the legislative assembly, they are entitled to certain privileges. Uh, but this is despite the fact that repeatedly the common man has uh, turned around to say, no, you don't. First, deliver on what you're supposed to, uh, to do, do your job, what you were voted for, and then ask for any privileges. That's, of course, the big story here. We would expect Mr. Vijay Goel to come out and uh, also give us a clarification of what really happened here.